eight functional objects based on bodily and architectural relations between my partner, mother, father, and myself. It came from two parallel interests dealing with furniture and everyday objects. The one is the, the way that these objects mediate relationships between people, and the other is uh, the way that they physically accommodate and even represent our bodies uh, just by the way that they're built to, uh, to suit our bodies in specific tasks so that a, a table will be always a, seat, a certain height or a step stool will also be a certain height. And so I, I chose domestic objects and uh, decided to deal with two specific domestic relationships. One, uh, the relationship between my partner and myself. The other, the relationship between my mother and my father. And I took specific measurements that would uh, represent these relationships uh, using the bodies of the people involved and a little bit of the architecture involved. So some examples of measurements would be uh, the difference in height between my partner and I or the surface area of my body. And so these objects are all set against one another uh, so that all these relationships and the measurements that uh, are involved in the pieces can be set against each other and uh, illustrate the relationships involved. And uh, I want to use specific measurements so that uh, the people who come into the gallery can try and imagine what the object would look like if it was taken from their body, if it would be wider or higher or however it would be different. Uh, so they can think about the way that everyday objects we encounter all the time already have a similar relationship in that they accommodate our body but also uh, represent people in a way and, and deal with an absence of person in the object.